Well, Hannibal, welcome to Birmingham City Football Club. How does it feel to have signed here? Thank you very much. Um, it's an honour to come and play uh, in this club. I heard a lot of things, a uh, lot of good things from my friends who played there before. So I'm uh, ready to, to come and play for this club. Good. Um, what do you want to get out of this loan spell? I want uh, some experience, learn more about uh, English football. Everyone told me like championship is the it's one of the hardest league in the world, harder than Premier League. So I'm ready to 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 play here. Yeah, you are known for being very passionate on yeah. the pitch. Where does that come from, and why are you like that? I don't like losing. So of course, uh, I think with me. We see it more, but I don't think no one likes losing, so I'm, I'm, I'm just a bad loser, I think. Where does your love of football come from? Who, who taught you? Um, I used to go watch my brother who used to play football, and uh, I was the mascot of the team. And when I go home, I try to do the same thing. And with the age, I, I choose uh, the club of my, my city, play there worked hard and here I am. Of course. And you got the move to England with Manchester United. How has your time in England with the Red Devils been so far? It's good, good. Um, it's been uh, easy to, to get used to the England uh, weather, <laughs> England uh, football as well. <laughs> yeah. But a uh, lot of people help me a lot. I get advised a lot, so I, uh, I hope to show everything. Yeah, the last year has been very big for you in terms of transitioning as uh, from a under 21s reserve player to, mm -hmm. to the first team and being in that environment. What has that taught you as a player, being in that first team circle? And being in a first team environment is it's different. Like when the team lose, you feel it. Mm -hmm. When we win, you feel it as well. So you learn a lot. You learn how to to act, to how to train. It's very different. And then there is some uh, big names in the team, so you learned a lot. Of course. How do you find being in and around those big names? Is it about learning as much as you can all the, all the time? Yeah, I think that's the only thing I, I can do. If I don't play, I have to learn, ask some questions and, uh, and, and follow what they do. Yeah. In, for, for Birmingham fans that might not have seen you play too much, um, tell us about yourself as a player. Where do you enjoy playing and, and where is your best position? I think uh, midfield as a number 8 or 10. That's my best position. But uh, um, some coaches put me on the, on the left wing sometimes, so I do the job for the team. And uh, everywhere where I can play is, is better. Yeah, it's about playing football. Yeah, just football. And course. Um, did anyone inspire you growing up? Did you watch anyone's game that you particularly liked and thought, I'll style myself on, on them? Yeah, yeah, I used to like uh, a lot uh, Zidane because uh, I'm Tunisian and French. So Zidane inspired me a lot. And uh, Iniesta, more Spanish football technique. So, yeah. yeah. You mentioned Zidane there and, and your country, Tunisia. You've represented them a number of times. Yeah. Um, that must make you feel very proud. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's an honour to, to play for my country. Every time I, I put uh, my foot on the field, and it's a pleasure, you know, playing for his country, represent his country. It's, it's the best feeling, I think. Yeah, you had a very good run in the Arab Cup last year, many Man of the Match performances and got to the final as well. Um, what does international football teach you as a player, playing in new places and, and playing with new teammates as well? No, it's, uh, it's very different because we, we get to fly a lot, um, see some other countries and it's in Africa. It's different football, so I learn a lot. But when we went to the Arab Cup, it was high level, nice pitch. So I could show myself and, and play good football and hopefully I can do the same here and the World Cup is coming as well. Yeah, you mentioned um, at the start of the interview a couple of players that have played for Birmingham from Manchester United yeah. recently, Ted and Mengi and of course Tahith Chong as well. Have you spoken to them about the move and, and, and what they thought about here? Yeah, yeah, I spoke to them. They told me good things. Good things. Yeah, <laughs> they told me the fans was uh, on fire. So hopefully... I can make make them happy. 
I'm sure you can. Hannibal, welcome to Birmingham City. Really looking forward to seeing you out there. Thank you.